The BMW iX electric SUV has been launched in India at a price of 1 crore 16 lakh rupees ex showroom. BMW is offering the new iX in just a single X Drive 40 variant and deliveries will begin in April 2022. The 2021 BMW iX is built on the brand's new architecture and uses an aluminium space frame chassis. The model gets futuristic design and a tech-laden interior sporting the best of luxury. Exterior highlights include the signature kidney grille design, slim LED tail lights, 21-inch alloy wheels, and the titanium bronze finish all over. Power comes from the fifth-generation all-electric powertrain that uses two electric motors for a combined power output of 322 brake horsepower and 630 Nm of peak torque. The SUV claims a range of 425 km on a single charge. The electric offering arrives in the country as a completely built unit and competes with the likes of the Mercedes-Benz EQC, Audi e-tron and the Jaguar I-Pace. The new generation Maruti Suzuki Celerio went on sale in India just last month and the company has already garnered over 15,000 bookings for the hatchback. While this certainly shows that there is high demand for the new Celerio, the car also commands a waiting period of up to 12 weeks depending on the variant. This is mainly due to the supply constraints caused by the current shortage of electronic components and semiconductor chips. The Maruti Suzuki Celerio entered the new generation after about 7 years and the model gets a complete overhaul sporting new design, features and an updated engine. Maruti also claims that the new Celerio is India's most efficient petrol car with a claimed average of 26.68 km per litre. The model is sold with manual and AMT gearbox options. Maruti also confirmed that the previous generation Celerio sold an average of 5,000 to 6,000 units per month, which puts the new version right on track in terms of demand. After losing the lead at the start of the race, Max Verstappen overcame a deficit of more than 10 seconds to Lewis Hamilton to claim his maiden F1 world title and denying Hamilton his record-breaking 8th world title. Hamilton was caught on the back foot when Nicholas Latifi crashed 5 laps before the end of the race, which triggered a safety car that enabled Verstappen to get a free pit stop for soft tyres. Mercedes decided not to pit Hamilton in order to maintain track position but Hamilton was on old and worn-out tyres by now. In a controversial move, it had been decided that the lapped cars wouldn't be allowed to overtake at the restart, but the decision was changed in favour of ending the race with the cars racing. Verstappen immediately overtook Hamilton when the safety car came in, which was the last lap of the race, and he went on to cross the chequered flag first. The controversial decision did see protest from Mercedes, but the stewards dismissed the same. Mercedes has now appealed to a higher court over the stewards' decision. We simply love, love, love hearing from you. So your comments and feedback are important. Subscribe to our channel, react to this video, and of course, watch our other videos too.